So, today we're going to try something that... Well, greetings, everybody. Oh, we're Isela and Jose yes. from Technically a Conversation. That's right. Technically a Conversation podcast. Yep. A lot of fun. You guys should go listen to it, download all the episodes. Absolutely. We're back with another crazy video, hosers. Actually, no, I shouldn't say hosers. <laughs> I heard, I heard a, another podcaster say that and it stuck in my mind. It is funny, actually. It's your fault, the old port. <laughs> oh, anyway, super friends, we're back with another crazy video. With a great suggestion from. Oh, from Chelsea Grin. Thank she you. was the inspiration behind this video and she told us where we could find it. Yes. So thank you so much. Super, super homie shout out to Chelsea. Thank you so much. Um, but this is before we taste it. I'm very curious because even the person who showed us where they are that worked at Walmart said, you like those? And he said it like in a very judgy way. Uh, we should explain to them what we're going to eat because from the offset, it looks like it's just regular Reese's peanut True. butter cups. This is not just a regular peanut butter cup. This, this ain't your grandma's Reese's peanut butter cup. <laughs> it's Reese's potato chips big cup. What? So basically what that means is it has crushed up chunks of potato chips inside the Reese's peanut butter cup. I don't really know how this is going to go, Daniel. Neither do I, but I have my beer so that way I can cleanse my palate. As do I. I don't know if that's going to be any better. Either. Though. All right. All right. I'm gonna. Hand oh, you, you already one. touched that one. Oh. I touched the bottom. Oh, okay. I'm kidding. It's gonna be. Don't be like such a pain. Okay. All right. It what smells just like regular chips. I mean, <laughs> get lushy. It smells like a regular peanut butter cup. So I'm kind of excited because I really do like Reese's. It does smell like a uh, regular chips. This actually is... regular peanut butter cup. <laughs> I just wanted to follow your lead. But this is too big, though. Like, That's what she said. No. <laughs> Look how big this is. Yeah, it's it's pretty girthy. <laughs> My so goodness. It's already starting to melt. It so is. I think we better eat I'm it take right a away. Bite now. Uh -huh. mm. Oh. Mm, I don't like the crunch already. I have to disagree with you. I think the crunch is a nice touch. And I like uh, the just the juxtaposition between the sweet and the salty. These are fantastic. I wasn't sure what I was getting myself into, <laughs> but it's really good. No, I when I, I think when I bite into a peanut butter cup, that's what I like is the smooth kind of creaminess um, consistency factor. But as far as the flavor is concerned, it actually does have a good flavor because you're right. That sweet and savory thing really works for me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's really good. So definitely go try them. I know it sounds gross. I'm, he said people say it's gross, but they're liars. Yeah, they're, it's really good. Yeah. So rating, Isela, Ooh. before these things finish melting on us. I know they're gonna melt. Um, one through 500? One, <laughs> one through five. One through five? I'm actually gonna go like, how many Michelin stars four. would you give this? No, I would give it, I would give it a four. This is so good. I just don't. I just wish they were crushed up smaller. I don't like them. I would have to give it the full five stars. Wow. It's really good. Wow. Okay. Or if it was Michelin, it would be three Michelin stars, <laughs> which is the highest at a Michelin star. Okay. All right. Wow. With the potato chip. Yeah. Now you've heard it here, folks. It's excellent. Yeah. So in case you guys were wondering. In case you guys thought this was some unholy abomination, you now know that it's delicious. Yeah, check it out.